It turns out that the village has been circulating a mysterious legend. It is said that there is a group of man-eating monsters hiding in the dense forest around the village. The monsters are particularly fond of the color red, but particularly afraid of the color yellow. 100 years ago, the monsters made a pact with the village elders. As long as the villagers do not enter the forest, they will not attack them. But this agreement was broken one night. A man on guard at the entrance of the village suddenly heard a rush of footsteps. The man thought that the shift was coming. Instead, he saw a red shadow pass by. He immediately rang the alarm bell. The villagers heard the bell and knew that a monster had entered the village were scared and ran around. The main character Jack is helpful. He first carried the fallen child home. On the other hand, Lisa, who is blind, stands at the door. She insisted on waiting for Jack to enter the house with her because she knew in her heart that Jack would not leave her alone. Lisa slowly reached her hand out to the door. She looked forward to Jack's arrival, but she didn't know that the monster was already close to her. The sound of the monster's roar frightened her, just as the beast was about to eat her. A warm hand pulled Lisa into the room just in time. Jack immediately closed the door. He took Lisa and hid her in a secret room inside the house. After dawn, the doors of every house were painted with a strange red mark. The village chief immediately called the villagers to discuss countermeasures. They found out that the monster had entered the village all because of Jack.